A further development of the 155mm Israeli family of howitzers from Soltan Systems, now part of Elbit Systems, was the 155mm autonomous towed howitzer Athos 2052, the last two digits 52 indicate the length of the barrel in calibers. Yes, but it does not have a feature that many others do not have. Athos 2052 is mounted on a towed carriage, which ensures its delivery to the battlefield. In the deployment area, the howitzer is able to maneuver independently, using its diesel engine and special hydraulic wheel drives. The hydraulic system allows the howitzer to be easily deployed using hydraulic jacks and auxiliary wheels. I agree, I also want to say that. It is equipped with an ammunition loader. Within a few minutes, Athos 2052 is able to leave its position on its own and be deployed to a new position a few hundred meters from the previous one. Subscribe to the channel, it will be more interesting. Thank you in advance. To control a howitzer, a crew of four to six people is required. When deploying a howitzer, no physical force is used. The use of a 155mm barrel and a 52 caliber length makes it possible to achieve a maximum firing range of 41 km using standard NATO ammunition, including 48 kg ERFB-BB shells with a charge of 11 or modular charges. I think it is necessary to mention that. The howitzer is equipped with an autonomous navigation and positioning system, a ballistic computer and modern digital communication equipment, which allows obtaining target coordinates and providing accurate fire support. This goes without saying, but let's get back to its features. Hydraulic actuators are used for vertical aiming of the gun and traverse, and they can be completely controlled by a computer for automatic aiming of the howitzer. Two 12-volt batteries provide the power needed to power various electronic devices, and also allow the use of an electrohydraulic pump for quiet operation. Standard equipment on the Athos 2052 includes a hydraulic generator, a GPS receiver and an onboard fire control computer. Don't forget there is one more feature. To determine the initial velocity of the projectile, a radar can be installed on the barrel that transmits data to the fire control system. Thanks for the tip let's continue. The Athos 2052 is reported to weigh around 13,000 kilograms. In addition to the 155 mm by 52 caliber configuration offered on the market, the Athos 2052 howitzer is also available in other configurations, 155 mm by 39 and 155 mm by 45 calibers. To date, it has been reported on the further development of the howitzer and its preparation for small-scale production. The main feature of this howitzer is that although it is towed, it has the ability to move due to its mechanism of movement. Such modifications to towed guns are very rare, although the benefits of such modifications are obvious. Don't forget to subscribe and like.